First, we need to prep your USB drive. Plug it in. Make sure it's at least 20 gigabytes. Format it. We need a clean slate. Open up your command prompt CMD and use it to format the drive. Don't worry, I'll provide the specific command later. Guys please like and subscribe so let's get to it. Next let's get Python. Head to the Microsoft Store. Open up the Microsoft Store app on your computer. Search for Python, type Python in the search bar and install it. Close the installer. Once it's done installing, close the installer window. Now let's prepare the OpenCore package. Download the package. Download the OpenCore package. You'll find the link in the description. Unzip it, once downloaded unzip the package. Find the utility. Inside the unzipped folder, navigate to the utilities folder, then to the Mac recovery folder. Open it in command prompt, right click on the Mac recovery, file and select, open with command prompt, or you can simply double click on it. Run the command. Once the command prompt opens, I'll provide you with a specific command to enter. Choose your macOS version. Select your desired version. Decide which macOS version you'd like to install. For example, if you want the latest version, choose Sequoia. But for me, I'll get Sonoma. Copy the installation code. Obtain the specific installation code for your chosen version. Run the installation. Press Enter to execute the command and start the installation process. Download Transmac. Once the macOS download finishes, return to your web browser and download the tool called Transmac. Follow the instructions. Follow the specific steps outlined in the guide to prepare your USB drive for installation.
After completing all steps, unplug the USB drive from your computer. Then, plug it into your Mac to initiate the macOS installation process. For more tips and tutorials, be sure to like and subscribe to our channel.